Installation instructions for Sound Eater underlayment systems. The Sound Eater panels and profiles must acclimate in their sealed packaging for 24 to 48 hours in regulated humidity and temperature conditions. The floor surface must not have irregularities exceeding one eighth of an inch over three feet. Sound Eater can be installed over wood or concrete subfloors. The subfloor must be dry, clean, and free of dust. Install double-sided tape on the subfloor along the perimeter walls. Install 4 mil poly sheeting onto the double-sided tape. In case of a subfloor heating system, use 6 mil. The edges must overlap one another by at least 8 inches. The joints must be sealed along their entire length with sound seals waterproof aluminum tape. Using a utility knife, cut the first row of sound eater panels in half over their total lengths. Place the first row of sound eater panels in the corner against the half inch spacers. Proceed to install full size sheets, ensuring that the wooden profiles are flush with the top of the panels. Install the wooden profile with the mated tongue and groove connection, making sure that the wooden profile is flush with the top of the sound eater panels. Face nail a six penny nail to fasten starter course of solid hardwood flooring into wooden nailers. Proceed to nail the hardwood floor into the wooden profiles using nails that are no longer than one and a half inches. After removing spacers from perimeter walls, install trim board leaving a slight gap to prevent sound flanking into the walls. 